Well, good morning, everybody. It's early o'clock for us. Just gone five. No, it's about six o'clock now. We've been up an hour, just having my second coffee of the day. And it's a beautiful morning here. As you get um, behind me, the mist is down. Could just make the silhouette out of the mountain. Um, beautiful, part, beautiful part of the day this is here in Panger. It's absolutely beautiful. And so, we've pretty much packed what well, we have. Um, and our journey begins today. So, our friends are going to pick us up at 7 and we head towards Phuket so it should take us just over an hour to get to the airport check in at 8.30 so it should be around about right and then yeah Phuket to Istanbul part one of the journey okay guys speak to you later hi everybody so this is the second first part of the journey up to Phuket um, to get the flight at 11.30 check in 8.30 okay guys speak later it's the international airport and we're just about to check in at B, the Turkish Airlines. Really nice airport here actually, it's my first time flying out of Phuket. Uh, so I've not been back to the UK for three years. So, um, yeah, first time flying out. See you later guys. Hi right, guys, um, we checked in with Turkish Airlines, that was pretty painless. Really, really easy to check in. Not many people around, it is low season here in Thailand at the moment. But, easy thing, easy check in, all good. Hi right, guys, so here we are, got through um, immigration and um, all good, pretty quick actually. And we're just in the duty free bit, this is their side now. As you can see, oh, I nearly said as you can see again, but hey, I'm going to say it as you can see. Ours is gate 14, uh, we've got about an hour to wait until um, we start boarding. So let's have a little look outside. Yeah, nice tidy airport, little bit here, food's up the top, up there. Everything here, okay, see you later guys. Oh, here we go, just a little bit down, and the you free. Leo and Draft there, look. Never seen that before. Hi oh guys, so we've made it to Istanbul. This is the biggest airport in the world at present. All good, so we just went up a dead end. We're now going through the international departures. We've got two hours before our flight leaves. So that's where we're heading now, hopefully. So, see you in a minute, guys. Pretty empty. Hi, guys. Um, this airport's absolutely massive. It's the biggest airport in the world so far. There's lack of signs of where you've got to go. You've got your sign here, your departures, but there's no signs up to where you've got to go. It just says transfers. But however, we've got a couple of hours. Looks like I've been walking around for a couple of hours. Hey guys, we made it to the, to the main hall. You can see there's everything to eat and everything to buy. Pretty cool though. There we go. CBs. Everybody, well I hope you liked the last video, will it be a little bit short, it's about Phuket International Airport and Istanbul International Airport, which is the biggest airport in the world now. The journey was pretty painless really, um, I think we've done the wrong thing in choosing a morning flight because it's taken a few days to get over the jet lag and I've never really experienced that before, it's normally a night flight we do and you're tired and you get over the jet lag a little bit more. But um, 
Look out for part two got, uh, for some more videos, obviously, of us in the UK, visiting our grandchildren and the little things we get up to. Okay, so thanks for 135 subscribers. Don't forget to ring that bell for notifications, comments below, and any ideas that you want me to follow or uh, try and help out of the videos that I do. Again, thanks very much, guys. And don't forget, stay safe.